Today on Stuart Cox Family News. A volcano erupted in Hawaii early Monday morning, the U.S. Geological Survey said. The agency's Hawaiian Volcano Observatory issued a warning that the Kilauea volcano eruption on the Big Island could shoot volcanic ash into the atmosphere. Now let's see the clip. We continue this morning with our top story breaking news overnight on Hawaii Island. Kilauea volcano is erupting. Our Robert Buon is now live with the latest from Hawaii Island officials. Good morning, Robert. Cynthia, good morning. I spoke with USGS moments ago, and as you mentioned, an eruption of Kilauea is happening right now. Here's a look at the Halemaumau Summit caldera right now from USGS thermal cameras. It's, uh, you can see the glow is visible within the pit crater, indicating that lava is currently erupting from fissures. The USGS reports that eruption began around 12.30 this morning, south of the Kilauea caldera and north of the Kauai Fault System and Helena uh, Pali Road in Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. Increased earthquakes at the summit on Sunday rumbled across parts of the island. Mo moments ago, I spoke with Ken Hong from USGS and asked the scientists in charge at the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory if it's true that there currently is no imminent danger. This is true, and we expect this eruption if it's like the December 1974 eruption that only lasted for about six hours. So the real problem is getting to the eruption while it's going rather than having the eruption getting someplace where it'll bother people. And it's out in a very unoccupied part of the park. So there's no direct threat to any uh, structures, roads, not even trails at this point. Um, it might, there's a possibility it could overrun the Southwest Desert Trail uh, to the east of Mono. That's about the only thing out there that is in any threat at the moment. Han noted that they had a field crew on the scene within the hour or so of eruption, but they were having a hard time getting close. So it was a long way still from the eruption site to where they were with that area. Very rugged, not possible for them to walk around there in the dark, which makes sense we, since we are just four days away from a new moon. But his team is fully ready to mobilize here within the hour, including a helicopter team, sunrise on Big Island at 543 this morning.